Donald Trump Jr. took to Twitter to defend his father Thursday morning, as former FBI Director James Comey testified before the Senate Intelligence Committee. Paul Ryan, Dan Scavino Jr., and Sarah Huckabee Sanders all defended President Donald Trump as well. Trump Jr. responded to Comey's statement that he took President Trump's words, quote, I hope you can let this go, about the Flynn investigation as an implied direction. He tweeted, Knowing my father for 39 years, when he orders or tells you to do something, there is no ambiguity. You will know exactly what he means. Trump Jr. added, Hoping and telling are two very different things. You would think that a guy like Comey would know that. Hashtag give me a break. Paul Ryan said at his weekly news conference, I would just say that of course there needs to be a degree of independence between the Department of Justice, FBI, and the White House, and a line of communications established. He continued, the president's new at this. He's new to government, and so he probably wasn't steeped in the long-running protocols that establish the relationships between DOJ, FBI, and White Houses. White House spokesperson Sarah Huckabee Sanders also defended Trump in a briefing Thursday, saying, I can definitely say the president's not a liar. Trump's director of social media, Dan Scavino Jr., took to Twitter during the hearing, posting about Hillary Clinton and, like many other conservatives, pointing out that Comey said Trump was not personally under investigation. President Trump did not tweet about Comey's hearing during the open session. CBS News reported he watched the testimony with his lawyer. For the latest updates on this story and more reactions to the Comey testimony from politicians and public figures, check out THR.com. I'm Tiffany Taylor for The Hollywood Reporter News.